everybody. You're watching the Palmetto Outdoor Experience. Today, I wanna to talk about optics. I wanna talk about magnified optics and how easy it really is to get it set up for your bow. Don't let it intimidate you. It's not that hard. Um, what I'm running is an HHA Sports Optimizer Light. My vision's really good, actually very good. And um, I do a lot of field round shoots stuff like that. Um, I haven't done any indoor yet or nothing like that. We have a range at my brother's place and we do a lot of uh, a lot of field rounds. Well, I was really wanting to tighten up my groups, trying to be a better archer. Really, really, really wanting to uh, perfect it. So, the, uh, the optic that I bought, and now I will go ahead and say this. My personal opinion, single pin is the way to go. There's no guesswork, there's no confusion. You don't pull the wrong pin. Now, you might look at the wrong, you know, movement right here, but that's your fault if you do it. So let's get to the optic. Um, I ordered this glass offline. Um, it was a company that sold the HHA uh, lenses. Very easy to do, and you can remove this in and out. Let's say you're out hunting or, or whatever, and you, uh, you know, something happens or, or anything, you know, let's say you, you break your glass cracks, whatever you can, it's simple. You unscrew it, screw it back in. The installation of this thing was very simple. It took less than five minutes and it's perfect. This one here is a six power and, um, it did require me to get a clarifier for the bow or for the uh, peep sight. And I believe for the clarifier, the specialty peep, because you will have to have a threaded peep and everything. I think out of pocket, I had $80 that includes the tie-in and everything for the bow. And, um, you know, it's, it's great. I can be at, you know, it is a six time magnification. So I can be at 60 yard and it looks like I'm at 20. I mean, it blows the center of that target up and it has greatly increased my accuracy. So, um, right now we're just here at 20 yard. We might take a couple of shots of this thing and I'll let you guys just see it. Um, you know, I haven't been able to find very many videos online of the HHA, um, sport optimizer light, especially any that's magnified. So hopefully this video will help you guys out. Um, I think the website I bought it on was something like Homesteaders Outdoors or something like that. Um, I can find it and put it in the link. Um, the, the glass, the housing and everything was right at $60. So, you know, for under, um, well, around $150, I got a fully magnified setup for my bow and it is well worth the money. Um, I debated it for a long time. My dad actually has a bow that's magnified and I shot it instantly fell in love he shot a uh, or he shoots a four power and I got the six I'll never turn back it's a good in between everything um, you know you can see great at 20 and you can see great at 80 I've shot 80 yard I shoot 100 yard um, it's a little difficult to shoot 100 with this setup because my tape max is out at 90 so you do have to aim a little bit high but I have some videos of me shooting 100 yard on my on my channel so Enough talking, let's do some shooting. All right, so um, I don't know if you guys can really see the magnification in the, uh, in the scope with this angle, but I'll just show you. Um, I'm not sure if you can see it. Probably not a smart idea to uh, be pointing a bow at a $1,200 iPhone, 12 Pro Max. <laughs> I really wish you guys could see what it looks like through here. If you could imagine a rifle scope, which I'm sure plenty of you guys shoot rifles and stuff like that, it's the exact same look. It's six time magnified. It is a hundred percent clear. Um, depending on your vision and everything, you will have to get, you'll have to match up your glass and your peep. And uh, normally the bow shops have a little tool that you can use, but it, it's no time for them to switch it in and out. You know, they can, 
they'll get you set up. Um, it it's not hard. It took I think it took less than five ten minutes in order to uh, figure out what glass I needed, and I'll tell you. I have shot this thing now probably close to a thousand times with the glass in it. I don't have any trouble with this coming loose, glass rattling, nothing like that. It's it's solid. Oh, I love the way it looks too. I just wish, really wish you guys could see it. We'll just put a couple more airs down there. I know this this bow, I bought it about six months ago and I have shot it thousands of times. Oh yeah. You can kind of see the magnification just a little bit. I know you can't see the peep, of course. All right, so let's shoot a 20 yard droop. Uh, I'm gonna try not to bust in the air, so I'm not really gonna try to stack them in there too close because I don't want to mess up any airs. These are very expensive. Black Eagle Rampages, but now I've got all kind of all kind of specialty weights and points and all kind of crazy stuff. I need to make a video on that one day. Smoked. I think I pulled on that one. I do believe I did. But I don't want to really stuck them in there too tight either. Like I said, I do not want to mess up any arrows. And I've done it. I busted a bunch. Gets expensive. Expensive in a hurry, too. Not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> 